a lower body. So I will make a little improvement to my old, old rubber boat here because when I'm sailing, it will splash a lot of water up uh, at the engine here and that's pretty annoying, but it's a very good boat. But people told me that it's because of the height of this one. So it's not high enough. And I got a new one there and it's at about two inch higher than, uh, than this one. And, and it doesn't splash water out. So I will try to improve this by putting So I am going to take a piece of wood and place here and I will screw it on and remove this one up and also on the other side so it will be uh, safe enough to sail it. Uh, this one is actually a little bit better because it got a uh, it got an inflammable uh, button and that one uh, makes a V shape and that's pretty easy to steer this one. When you are sailing very fast and you are going around, it will go into a water like a speedboat. This one, it doesn't have that. It have an inflammable thing in the middle and it's got a hard floor, but it's not a V shape at all. So when you are turning in high speed, it will do, 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 do over the water and that doesn't feel very safe. So I will go uh, to improve my old one and uh, have that uh, improve with this one. and. Uh, Let's see uh, how it will sail. So let's put it back together. Okay, so now it's actually on. So I put uh, eight screws into it. I drilled them in since so they are halfway in and uh, they're seven centimeters, so they should hold. It feels pretty stiff uh, without this one. So uh, I put it on and thought, will it hold my engine? Because I will not drop the engine in the water. Then I thought, my engine is holding by this plate and there's only a few screws in it and a few screws in the other side. So this bar, it should hold up or else you will see me crying in a video. Hey, come in the Hello again. So I'm back from my trip. Does this improve my boat? <laughs> yes, it does. Because First of all, the water splashing that I told you about, uh, my main issue was uh, actually uh, better. There's no water splashing up this way anymore and it doesn't splash up high. It just splashes this way. So that's uh, good, it improved. And also the speed of my boat is improved because uh, before it sailed uh, 38 kilometers an hour and now it's up to 40 kilometers an hour. I have done a lot of tests with my engine. It's a 15 horsepower two-stroke uh, Johnson from 98 and uh, it's sailing very good. So um, now I've tested this on it and it's improved my rubber boat pretty much, I think. And uh, one thing with this boat that I love is the V-shape that I told you all before, but also this. Those two pump tongues here does actually that my... Um, when I take the new one that don't have the V-shape, when I'm speeding up, it's right away. Uh, it goes very high, but those two, two fins here actually does that it doesn't do it like that. And that's pretty awesome that I got this on this one. So it's my old one, but I will definitely use this one. I will not use the new one because the only thing that it's great with the new one is uh, you can be one more person in it. It got two seats and it's have a hard uh, bottom. I like that it's aluminum, it's great, but it's not that great. So if you want to improve your own, you can do it like I did here. It's simple and cost nothing at all. It took me a half an hour to make. So uh, sail out there and uh, be safe. <laughs>